The following trailer is rated S for spoilers. Presented by Movies Anywhere. Your movies, together at last. Download the Movies Anywhere app today and bring your movie collection together. You love Pokemon and Ryan Reynolds. You definitely hate video game movies. And you probably don't have a hot take on film noir. Now, Legendary will mush it all together and hope something clicks in Pokemon Detective Pikachu. Get ready, Poke fans! After 21 animated movies, 22 seasons of TV, and countless video games, Pokemon is finally getting a live-action film based on a weird spin-off that no one bought outside Japan. I'm sorry, but can we investigate your cloaks? Mommy! 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 But a mystery game for six-year-olds was probably the right choice to adapt, since every other Poke thing is a dogfighting simulator, pay-to-win card game, or a playable corpse finder. I just want to go see a dead body. What? See all of your favorite Pokemon come to life on the big screen, like Charizard, the, uh, the tongue one, mm. or, ah, what is that thing? Ditto! Ah. But for those who don't know or care, grab a hold of Ryan Reynolds' Pikachu. I will electrocute you! A detective whose wisecracking charm could carry a premise as dumb as, well, Detective Pikachu. Because no matter how you feel about Pokemon, this is the closest we'll get to a new Deadpool for a while. And I mean, come on, just look at the little guy. Look at his little hat. Oh! Wait, what was I saying? Uh, yeah, the movie's alright. I mean, he's a Pikachu who's a detective. Y you get what you pay for. When you need someone to act scared of an animated lizard, you call Justice Smith. Unravel the mystery of his missing dad, who, spoiler alert, is the character who sounds exactly like his dad. That's a twist. That's very twisty. Dopinner could have cracked this in like five seconds, but with the help of this girl from a completely different movie. But I don't fear fear. I walk the walk and I talk the talk and I'm willing to do whatever it takes to get the honest scoop and that's the hard truth. They'll uncover a businessman's secret plot to merge humans and Pokemon because movie? I mean, I get why he would want a Pokebody, but why would he bother to make all of humanity? Oh, there's my furry widow guy. Who's my Pika Pika? You don't have to make any sense at all, do you? No. In a franchise known for fighting, get only the tiniest glimpse of its potential. Then thrill at action set pieces where our heroes run away from a Pokemon. Run away from a Pokemon. Run away from a Pokemon. Run away from this forest that's actually a Pokemon. And run away from a. Not for the games. Say it. Just say it. Pokemon. So get ready for a film that was a bit too dark for kids. Are you gonna make me into a lampshade? And a bit too cutesy for adults. Ah. But nonetheless, takes its rightful place as the third best hardboiled detective story featuring cartoon animals ever. Suck it, cool world. Starring. Justice for Smith, Little, Yellow, Different, April O'Neil, Coward the Duck, Tractor, Sad Lieutenant, Port of Call, Rhyme City. Honestly, this cat's trailer doesn't look so bad. Gas monkey, that junkie monkey. Wow. <laughs> Joker did it. And when you need a British stage actor to class up disposable pop culture, you call Bill Nye. No! What have you done? Who framed Ryan Reynolds? So for the sequel, how are they going to get Ryan Reynolds back inside the Pikachu? Or is it going to be the other way around? Ugh. No, no, no. This episode was brought to you by Movies Anywhere. You choose where to purchase your favorite movies. We'll bring them together in one place. Movies Anywhere. Download the app today. Rubber Baby Buggy Bumpers. Leslie, I typed your symptoms into the internet, and it says you could have network connectivity problems. 